Hello everyone, thank you for joining the prayer this day. I hope that you're well. I hope that you're well. Where are you joining from? Hi, I, where are you joining from? I hope you're well. Where are you joining from? What is your name? Where are you joining from? I hope that you're well. Glory to God. It's been a powerful series. It's been a powerful time since we started the prayers. Thank you. Hey, Pastor, how are you? Thank you. I'm seeing you waving at me. It's really nice to have you here. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor Amechi. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. We would like to pray from Ephesians chapter 3, verse 16. And I want to say to you, like I say all the time, if you are joining the prayer, it's good for you to be very specific about what you're praying about. It's good for you to be very specific about what you're praying about. It's good for you to be very specific. So I will counsel you to have a notebook. You write your prayer guides. You write the scriptures about it and begin to pray from a place of faith not just a place of emotion and not a place of fear. Ephesians chapter 3 verse 16, the Bible says this, that it will grant unto you, it will grant you according to the riches of his glory to be strengthened with might by the spirit in the inner man. We're going to start with a place of thanksgiving today. It's a place of thanksgiving. What are we thanking God for? We're thanking God for the gift of righteousness. We're thanking God for the forgiveness of sin. We're thanking God for his love that never fails. That God's love that never fails. Lord, I thank you for your love that never fails. I thank you for the gift of righteousness. I thank you for the forgiveness of sins. Let's go ahead and bless his holy name this morning. Bolo shale menengo roma sangali libu kamena skupre kite lebo roma nakatashwa esto kashte joshua brega dila brate masanto loma kata. Father, thank you for the gift of righteousness. Father, thank you for the forgiveness of sins. Thank you, Lord, for your love that never fails. Father, thank you for your love that never fails. Father, thank you for your love that never fails. Lord, thank you for your love that never fails. Father, thank you. <coughs> Lord, thank you for your love that never fails. Thank you for the gift of righteousness. Thank you for your love that never fails. I give you the praise. I give you the glory of God. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus name we pray. In Jesus name we pray. There's a popular song we sing, which is Ebenezer. But the real meaning of Ebenezer in the scripture means, Hitherto as the Lord helped us. It's a second place of thanksgiving. Father, thank you for how far you have brought me. How far you have brought me this year. How far you have brought me in my career. How far you have brought next level prayers. Father, thank you for how far you have brought me. Hallelujah. Thank you for how far you have brought me. Glory to God. Lord, I thank you. Lord, thank you for how far you have brought me. Libo rose mano koro mane keresuto. Baramanata. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, thank you for how far you have brought me. Look at, I remember where I used to be. I remember where I used to be. Look at your grace. Look at your favor. Look at your mercy. Look at how far you have brought me. Lord, in Jesus' name, I thank you for how far you have brought me. Lebroson tole mondo roma nakate ya. Jeleketondre baski brante le ruma san salamanta haya. I lift up my Ebenezer. Lord, thank you for how far you have brought me. Uh, spirit of the living God, I adore you. I worship you. Thank you for how far you have brought me. Thank you for how far you have brought me. I'm not where I used to be. I'm grateful. Oh God, you have elevated me. You have promoted me. Lord, you have taken me forward. Oh God, Father, thank you. You are the lifter up of my head. You are the lifter up of my head. Father, thank you for how far you have brought me. In Jesus' name we pray. Oh glory to God. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we're praying in Jesus name we pray thank you for how far you brought me we're going to pray that God will grant us this is what we quoted earlier Ephesians chapter 3 verse 16 and I will read to you he said I will grant you according to the riches of his glory to be strengthened with might by his spirit in the inner man you are going to pray Lord I receive you I receive strength Lord I'm praying that I will be strengthened in my inner man I come against spiritual weaknesses. I come against spiritual lethargy. I'm praying that I will be strengthened with might on the inner man. Legemando korobasana lama kora manande leketosh ea. That I will be strengthened with might in my inner man. That's my prayer today. I will be strengthened with might in my inner man. Everyone that is discouraged, everyone that is depressed, in the name of the Lord Jesus, begin to receive new strength. You will not get tired. You will not get exhausted. You will not fall out of the race. In the name of the Lord Jesus, 
Jesus Christ, I come against every spiritual weakness, every spiritual lethargy, every weakness in your emotion, every weakness in your body. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we lift to Ashka Palama, you will not give up on your dreams, you will not give up on your goals, you will not be exhausted, you will not be depressed, you will not be tired. Instead of your tiredness, receive strength. In the name of Jesus Christ, La Pashoto Kopene Masulo Mokapayataya, Like Manamro Katali Gros Caprataya, Eposte Kamana Brasso Copolo Mataya. Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, I receive renewed strength. In I will not be tired, I will not be weak. I receive renewed strength in the name of Jesus Christ. Zonske Parodoa, Alega Jatadada, Aleka Boromana Kesco, and Leke Bonte Kelebushka, and Leke Bontali Baramana, and Kele Bonte Lebronda Makata. I receive renewed strength in the name of the Lord Jesus. I receive renewed strength in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I will not be tired, I will not be exhausted, I will not give up in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah. I begin to type in the comment section. I receive renewed strength. I receive renewed strength. I receive renewed strength. I receive renewed strength. I receive renewed strength in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Today I receive renewed strength. In Jesus' name we pray. Job chapter 8 verse 7. This is very powerful. Job chapter 8 verse 7. He says, though your beginning was small, he said, your latter end shall be exceedingly great. You are going to declare with me that greater days are ahead of me. Better days are ahead of me. How do I know that? Job chapter 8 verse 7. He said, though your beginning may be small, he said, your latter end will be very great. I don't know what you think is great right now. God's word says it will get greater. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, Job chapter 8 verse 7. You can help me type in the comment section. Job chapter 8 verse 7. He said, though your beginning day, so your beginning was small, your latter end shall be exceedingly great. You are going to declare that in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, uh, that my Ashka Palama Nabarabada. Firstly, I'm going to declare, in every way I'm expanding. In every way I'm expanding. Uh, in every way I'm expanding. The singles are getting married. You're expanding in your finance. In every way you are expanding. The ministry is expanding. The word of God is expanding. You're expanding in every way. In the city where you are in, in Ibadan, you are expanding. In Johan you are expanding in Toronto. You are expanding in Ottawa. You are expanding in Canada. You are expanding in Houston. You are expanding in Texas. You are expanding in Baltimore. You're expanding in the city of London. You're expanding in Birmingham. You're expanding. He said, Though your beginning may be small, your latter end shall be very great. I said, you are expanding my city. Abone Santa Legaba, a Libra Zeus Celebradia, a Libra Zeus Celebradado, a Libra Zeus Celebrada Cataya. You are expanding in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Your expansion knows no limit. Your expansion knows no boundary. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, your expansion knows no limit. Your expansion knows no boundary. Go ahead and receive it. In Jesus' name we pray. I want to declare that I'm expanding without limit and boundaries. Go ahead, go ahead and write in the comment section. I'm expanding without limits and without boundaries. Hallelujah. I'm expanding without limits and without boundaries. I'm expanding without limits and without boundaries. In the name of Jesus Christ, every spirit of limitations and containment, I begin to command them to be scattered. I bind and cast out every spirit of limit, every spirit of containment. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every spirit of limitation, every spirit that contains, I bind and I cast them out. In the name of Jesus Christ, I bind and I cast them out. Whatever has put an embargo on your progress, whatever has put an embargo on your finances, on your spiritual growth, on whatever area of your life, I bind and I cast it out. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I bind and cast it out. In the name of Jesus Christ, I come against spiritual operations, uh, spiritual transaction, buying and selling the spirit uh, that on your case to make sure you are limited. I say such operation, I bind them. Uh, I say I cast them out. Uh, I say I bind them. Uh, I say I cast them out. Uh, I say I bind them. Uh, I say I cast them out. Uh, in the name of Jesus.
Let mono moro basambolo mono kora mania tala bashan de kapora. Sike le brende le kruto brate braka ba ma 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 ma. Lega le manson brade haya. Job chapter eight verse seven. We're still praying with the scripture. The Bible says, and though your beginning was small, it said your latter end was will be exceedingly great. You are going to declare that my future days will be better than my current days. You are going to prophesy into your future that my future will be brighter than my past. My future will be brighter than my present. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. He said, though your beginning will be small. He said, your, he said, he said, he said though your beginning will be small. He said that your latter days will be very great. I prophesy to you that your future days are. Come in the Roman Nacrasila that your future days will be way better way brighter way more fulfilling than your current days in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ your future will be brighter than your past your future will be brighter than your present in the name of jesus christ your future will be brighter and better than your past than your present your future will be brighter and better than your past and your present in the name of the lord jesus christ walk in an in whatever you do, receive an advantage over others. In the name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' name we're praying. In Jesus' name we're praying. I want to take a moment and go ahead and share the link with our friends. We just have about three more minutes to pray. Go ahead and share the link with our friends quickly. Oh, my cop, Alaya. Like a man, a carriage, a desocolo, robotica, la brata, la rava has cataya. Like a maso prataya. La bane copa ya catala maso prakataya mana cataya. Like a de bracatele rebesonto lo roba caya la brata in the mesanta la mania. Like a me, go ahead and take a minute and share the link with your friends. I did be a blessing to them. Be a blessing to them. Go ahead and share the link with them. Jeketele rebocum brataya gatasco bregadia la paya. Every ketele rebeshoketeada and palagata. They are going to declare, let the blessing of God attract all the help and support I need. Let the blessing of God attract all the help and support I need. And it's a blessing. Oh, Shataya. The Bible says the blessing of God make it rich and adds no sorrow to it. It's a prayer for you. I don't know where you're praying for. Let the blessing of God attract all the help, all the support you need. Either from the spirit realm or the natural realm. Let the blessing of God attract all the help and the support you need. Go ahead and begin to declare right now. Kora bashanda brate katato lege baraka pani mashandro kataya e karase tele gone brande kele rabashanta la raba haskos e ramanataya. Let the blessing of God, all the help that you need, receive it in the name of Jesus. Praise God, praise God, praise God, praise God. We're going to prophesy. The Bible says in the book of Zechariah chapter four. It says, What that mountain before Zerubbabel? It said, Thou shalt be made low. Every difficulty before you, I cast them by the anointing. Makopa later, Messiah. Every difficulty you're experiencing, either in marriage, either in your health, either with your funding, every mountain before you, I cast them by the anointing. Apashataya, you are going to declare every difficulty I cast you by the anointing, dry up from the root in the name of Jesus Christ. Every difficulty I cast you by the anointing, dry up from the root. Every difficulty you're experiencing, every complication you're going through, I curse you by the anointing. Everyone that is under the sound of my voice that has a difficulty, that is expressing a complication, I curse the complication by the anointing. I curse the difficulty by the anointing. I command to dry up from the root. I command the mountain to move out of your way. I command to move out of your way. I command to move out of your way. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every difficulty, every difficulty you're experiencing in the city where you are in, in the relationship you are in, in the transaction you are in, I command it to dry up from the root. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I curse it by the word of God. I curse it by the anointing. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every hardship you have experienced, let it dry up from the root. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. And this is the last, this is the last prayer guide. Amakayan, every spirit Amaya. I bind every spirit behind the hardship. I don't know what hardship you're going to. I bind spirit behind hardship. I bind spirit behind difficulty. Every spirit that sustained the difficulty. Every spirit that sustained the delay. 
in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I bind your spirit behind difficulty. I bind you and I cast you out. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I bind you and I cast you out. I bind you and I cast you out. Every spirit behind the hardship, every spirit behind the struggle, every spirit behind the no growth, I bind you and I cast you out. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every spirit behind it, I bind you and I cast you out. In the name of Jesus Christ, go ahead and declare. He said, whatsoever we shall bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. He said, whatsoever we shall loose on earth shall be loose in heaven. He said, he has given us a name that is above every other name. He said, as soon as strangers shall hear my voice, they shall be afraid out of the hiding places. Every spirit behind any difficulty, every spirit behind any hardship, every spirit behind any delay, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, such an unjust, I bind you today and I cast you out. I don't know why it has waited for such a long time, but today we take authority. Every spirit behind your frustration, every spirit behind the lack, every spirit behind the delay, every spirit behind the hardship, I bind it in the name of your Christ and I cast it out. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every spirit behind it, I bind it, I cast it out. In the name of Jesus Christ, I cast it out. In Jesus' name we pray. Oh, glory to God. I pray for you today that in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, every spirit that's caused you hardship, every spirit that's behind every delay, that's behind any frustration, that's behind any pain, that's behind any sickness, that's behind anything that's frustrating you. Today, I bind it and I cast it out. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I begin to declare over you, Mashokopoya, because of the anointing of God upon your life, you become a magnet for opportunities. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, because of the blessing of God, and grace upon your life you become a magnet for opportunities i wanted to type in the comment section i have become a magnet for opportunities oh palamana because of the blessing anywhere you are in you have become a magnet for opportunity in the name of the lord jesus i don't know if you heard me lakara soskabara manabrata barabada because of the blessing, you have become a magnet for opportunities. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, there's a, there's a word I give this morning, I want to say it again. Whatever good you have missed in life, I declare that such good is restored back to you. In the name of Jesus Christ, whatever good you have missed in life, I declare that such good has been restored back to you. Maybe you missed some opportunity, you missed some good. Whatever good you have missed, God says he restores the time and the season. He said the years the cacao that still will restore. Whatever good whatever good you have missed in life, I said it is restored back to you. You have become a magnet of opportunity. I wish I can get everyone online to begin to type in the comment section. In the city where you live, in the industry you operate, a bunch of family, you have become a magnet of opportunity. Type it quickly. I declare over you, Maito Caprate, Soprate, Brate, Lebra, Scopra Catale Bracataya, a Bros Catala Bayaga, a Nibro Shatala Brata Barabara. Whatever good you have missed in life, I said it is restored back to you. I said it is restored back to you. I said it is restored back to you. I said it is restored back to you in the name of Jesus. Oh my God. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. We give you praise for this. It is done. Whatever good you have missed, it is restored back to you. Whatever good you have missed, it is restored back to you. You have become a magnet for opportunities in Jesus' name. Thank you for joining us. Remember that this evening at 11 p.m. we have a special worship night. You can stream it online. I preach a powerful message for men and women. It's on YouTube. And I preached on prayer last Sunday. It was really powerful. Join us. And I want to say to you that this Sunday, I'm teaching about how to pray and see results. You will learn things about prayer you have never heard before. Join me in Harvest this Sunday. It will change your life forever. Thank you for watching. God bless you. God bless you.